Hello guys, this is What About Nintendo, and today I'm here for another drawing video. In this video, I'm going to be drawing Lucario. You can see the picture I'm basing it off of right here. Uh, I thought this one looked cool because you can kind of see like the shading is the way that the fireball in his hand actually lights up his face and the rest of his body and casts shadows and stuff, which I thought looked pretty epic, so that's why I chose this version of Lucario, but I'll be attempting to draw that. I'll put my own spin on it as well. Thank you to Cyndaquil for suggesting Lucario as a drawing video character. And I'll see you guys right after I'm done to talk all about how it went. See you guys. Okay, guys, we are done here. I think it came out uh, well enough. I'm looking at it right now. You guys can see it compared to the real um, thing I was basing it off of. So you can see how it compared to that. Obviously, I didn't do the entire of uh, you know the entirety of the picture. I kind of condensed it down because I couldn't quite. Uh, get it in proportion. I was trying to get it proportional correct, but I didn't want to make it too small And then I just ended up making it like this After multiple attempts this is the first drawing that actually took Multiple different pieces of paper where I just tossed away everything else that took me over two and a half hours to make Sorry if there's any background noise. There's a lot of things going on in my house right now uh, But I still wanted to record this so you guys get my thoughts on the project. So 
obviously the coloring is not exact. It's kind of annoying only having 100 colors because usually like when you have a computer you got like 16.7 million colors and if you have a HDR screen enabled you know then you got over a billion colors and it's just like all I have is 100 colors to work with so obviously the coloring can't be exact but I try to get it as close as I could add some purple in with the black and different things like that try to get it closer to where it was. I think the close-up shot actually looks more epic than the uh, farther away shot, uh, but maybe that's just me being biased, maybe that's just my way of coping with not being able to fit the entire thing in frame, but I think it came out pretty well. I'm kind of disappointed without the fireball itself turned out because the colors uh, eh, they didn't turn out all that well. Uh, I wish it was, I think it's because it's not smooth with the kind of uh, grainy look that a colored pencil has. The color, I like to call it the color pencil grain. I don't know if that's what they actually call it, but that's what I call it. I call it the color pencil grain where you can like tell like the different lines of things. You can tell where it's being put. That obviously shown through a lot because I mean it's a colored pencil. What are you going to do? So it, that kind of made it look uh, less fiery, I guess. I'm not even sure exactly how to describe it, uh, but it looks a little off. I'm glad with how the face turned out. I thought it was going to be a little smushed, which it's a tiny bit smushed, but it's not nearly as bad as I thought it was going to be at first. Um, and I like how the eyes came out with like the little like cartoon glow in their eyes. I think it looked pretty cool. And that's overall, I think it came out well. It took me way too long to do it. Way too many attempts. This was way harder than I thought it was going to be. Like I literally was just like, ah, this looks cool, but it also looks a little easy. That's fine. We'll do a little bit of an easier one a day. And then nope, this was not as easy. Not even close to as easy as I thought. But I think it came out cool. Uh, definitely not my best drawing, but definitely not my worst drawing either. I'm happy with it. Uh, but anyways, guys, that's all for this video. If you like this video, make sure to like and subscribe for more drawing videos like this and other videos on Monday through Friday, gaming live streams on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, and Coffee Talk Monday through Friday, where I chat with you guys around 11 a.m. Central Standard Time for about 30 minutes about the latest Nintendo news. Also, make sure to check out my Patreon because I'm adding a whole ton of new, uh, you know, exclusive and timed exclusive content to that. So make sure to check that out because there will be some content that you will not be able to see anywhere but my Patreon. So check that out down in the description below. And anyways, guys, I'll see all you guys later on What About Nintendo. Bye.